It's time to activate your Link Evo cellular trail camera. Following these instructions will ensure your camera is up and working quickly and easily. Before turning the camera on, be sure that you've installed a recently formatted compatible Class 10 SD card between 2 and 32 gigabytes. Open the battery compartment on the back of your Link Evo camera and locate the SIM barcode. At this time, open your SpyPoint app and select Activate New Camera and select the Link Evo from the model drop down box. Click Scan and hold the phone's camera over the barcode, then follow the on screen directions to complete the activation. Now go to the Settings tab. Under Basic Settings, change the delay to Instant. Then go to Cellular Setup and change the transfer frequency to each detection. We won't leave the settings like this, but we want to ensure that the camera is transmitting images properly. Install eight premium brand alkaline or lithium batteries into the battery compartment and turn the camera on. The signal bars to the left of the power switch will begin flashing. This means the camera is searching for signal. Once the lights stabilize, they will display the signal strength. Two to five bars is fine, but if you're only able to get one bar to light up, you may experience signal issues. Once signal has been established, the red countdown light will begin flashing. You have 30 seconds before the camera begins taking pictures. Once the red light stops flashing, move in front of the camera to trigger a detection and photo. Open your SpyPoint app again. Verify that the camera did communicate with the app when you turned it on by checking the status tab. From there, refresh the photos tab until your photos appear. This should happen in just a few minutes. Once the photos appear, you know that your camera is working properly and you're ready to place it in the field. Just be sure that when you put the camera in the field, you make sure that you have a strong, stable signal where it's placed to ensure proper transmissions and updates. If the camera shows updated connection times, but the photos do not show in your mobile app, shut the camera off and remove the SD card. Verify there are pictures in the DCIM folder by viewing the contents of the SD card on a computer. Reformat the card and reinstall the card into the camera. Turn the camera back on and complete the start camera directions once again. If the problem persists, contact SpyPoint customer service so they can help you troubleshoot the camera further. For more helpful and informative videos like this, visit spypoint.com support.